With doubtnet, get instant video solutions to all your maths, physics, chemistry and biology doubts. Just click the image of the question, crop the question and get instant video solution. Download doubtnet app today. Hello friends, here the question is, if a flag staff of 6 meter height placed on the top of a tower throws a shadow of 2 root 3 meter along the ground, then what is the angle that the sun makes with the ground? So now here, suppose this is a b, a b tower, suppose this is a a b tower of height h meter. Now here it is saying that, that flag staff of 6 meter height placed on the top of a tower. So here at the top of a tower, uh, 6 meter height, that is 6, suppose this is here 6 meter height, flag staff uh, placed on the tower. So here this is a flag staff, suppose its name is here c and here it is d and here it is a. So now here it is saying that uh, 2 root 3 meter throws a shadow along the ground that if that uh, this flag staff. So here suppose this is a root 3. 2 root 3 length this is ed because here this is the uh, shadow along the ground this is the distance along the ground of this flag staff now here angle subtended that is here theta and this is also equals to theta because this run shadow and this these two shadows run parallel so here we get this theta and this theta so now here we have to find the angle of that sun makes with the ground so here we have to find this angle of elevation that makes the ground ma makes the this flag with the ground so now here let us start the solution so now here in the triangle a b e we see that tan theta tan theta we get here in a triangle a b e tan theta is equals to we get here perpendicular perpendicular by perpendicular by base so here suppose this is base base is here x so here we get h by x now here in a triangle d c b in a triangle d c b tan theta is equals to we get here perpendicular by base so perpendicular is here h plus x h plus 6 sorry h plus 6 and here base is here x plus 2 root 3 so now here from here it is suppose first and here it is suppose second so now here from first and second we get here from first and second we get h by x is equals to h plus 6 by x plus 2 root 3 So now here from this here we get this hx plus h2 root 3 is equals to hx plus 6x. Now here this will hx hx will cancel out and here we get h2 root 3 is equals to <coughs> 6x. Now here we get h by x is equals to 6 by 2 root 3. So here we get 3 by root 3 this 6 uh, 2 1 2 2 3 is 6 so here we get 3 by root 3 now here we may write like this 3 root in 3 root 3 into root 3 by root 3 so here this root 3 root 3 will cancel out and here we get h by x is equals to root 3 so now here here tan theta is equals to h by x so here we may write like like this h by x is equals to tan theta so this is equals to tan theta so now here we know that root 3 is equals to root 3 is equals to tan 60 degree so here this is equals to tan theta so now here from this here we get theta is equals to 60 degree so now here we see that option first is the correct answer so this is the answer thank you for class 6 to 12 itj and neat level trusted by more than 5 crore students download doubt and app today